oldest thing to remember when comparing a deed of trust to a mortgage is that a deed of trust involves three parties, the lender, borrower, and a neutral third party that holds the rights to the real estate in question. And a mortgage only involves two parties, the lender and the borrower. Both are put in place to protect the lender if the borrower defaults on their loan. Lenders will typically prefer a deed of trust to a mortgage because if a borrower defaults, it's much simpler to foreclose on a property since the judicial process is not needed. Unfortunately, as the borrower, the decision on which to use is not up to you. This is determined on state level. Currently, 30 states plus the District of Columbia use a deed of trust, while the other 20 use a mortgage. I'm Stuart Brown, a licensed mortgage loan originator in Palm Springs, California, here to simplify topics in real estate and mortgage lending. Please like, share, follow, and subscribe.